Mercury was heavily bombarded by comets and asteroids during and shortly following its formation for six billion years ago, as well as during a possibly separate subsequent episode called the Late Heavy Bombardment that ended three eight billion years ago. Mercury received impacts over its entire surface during this period of intense crater formation, facilitated by the lack of any atmosphere to slow impactors down. During this time Mercury was volcanically active. Basins were filled by magma, producing smooth plains similar to the Maria found on the Moon. One of the most unusual craters is Apollodorus, or, the spider which hosts a series of radiating troughs extending outwards from its impact site. Craters on Mercury range in diameter from small bowl-shaped cavities to multi-ringed impact basins, hundreds of kilometers across. They appear in all states of degradation, from relatively fresh raid craters to highly degraded crater remnants. Mercurian craters differ subtly from lunar craters in that the area blanketed by their ejecta is much smaller. A consequence of Mercury's stronger surface gravity. According to International Astronomical Union rules, each new crater must be named after an artist who was famous for more than 50 years and dead for more than three years before the date the crater is named. The largest known crater is Caloris Planitia, or Caloris Basin, with a diameter of 1,550 kilometers. The impact that created the Caloris Basin was so powerful that it caused lava eruptions and left a concentric mountainous ring approximately 2 kilometers tall surrounding the impact crater. The floor of the Caloris Basin is filled by a geologically distinct flat plain, broken up by ridges and fractures in a roughly polygonal pattern. It is not clear whether they are volcanic lava flows induced by the impact or a large sheet of impact melt. At the antipode of the Caloris Basin is a large region of unusual hilly terrain known as the weird terrain. One hypothesis for its origin is that shock waves generated during the Caloris impact traveled around Mercury, converging at the basin's antipode 180 degrees away. The resulting high stresses fractured the surface. Alternatively, it has been suggested that this terrain formed as a result of the convergence of ejecta at this basin's antipode. Overall, 46 impact basins have been identified. A notable basin is the 400 km wide, multi-ring Tolstoy basin that has an ejecta blanket extending up to 500 km from its rim and a floor that has been filled by smooth plains materials. Beethoven Basin has a similar-sized ejecta blanket and a 625 km diameter rim. Like the Moon, the surface of Mercury has likely incurred the effects of space weathering processes, including solar wind and micrometeorite impacts.